welcome back to my channel. Hi if you're new here, hi if you're not. Thank you so much for clicking on my video and joining me. Today I'm going to be filming a summer haul part 2. <laughs> some good pieces that need to be put to the test because I ordered stuff from Stradivarius which I've never ordered from before and I've got so much of like the Limitless collection you know it's like the dupe for the Zara collection I've got a couple of things from Zara I'm watching this pile fall over when I say this pile of clothes is huge this is what we're working with um so this is definitely 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 a uh, summer haul because the Colours for summer, colours for summer, hear me out, colours for summer. There's just something so fun, there's something so fun about wearing colour in the summer. When the sun's out, get your matching accessories, oh my gosh, amazing. So yeah, I've got ASOS, Stradivarius, um, a couple of bits from Zara, and then I've got some more things from Primark that I picked up, um, and then Pretty Little Thing stuff as well. I ordered a, quite a few pair of jeans, and can I tell you, none of them fit. So if anyone can tell me where to get jeans that fit, that would be lush. If they fit around my waist and they're too short. Definitely stay tuned because there is some nice things in here that you're going to want to get your hands on. So thank you so much if you're here. Please like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram. I'll pop it on the screen here. We will start with Stradivarius. So I ordered quite a few bits from Stradivarius. I'm going to say that so many times. I'm probably going to be saying it wrong every single time. So I'll stop saying it. Um, got basically everything that's in the see it's the seamless comfort collection um i also ordered off the website and because i ordered so much i got free delivery did take ages to come but i mean you know it is what it is so i got this little top in an extra small she's definitely extra small and she's come with like can you see that it's like got marks on the front of it but these kind of tops are staple for summer. Just staple for every day, really, to wear with joggers, shorts, anything. And can I just tell you, the fit of this is amazing. Amazing. Like, I don't know what it is that makes it so flattering, but she looks gorgeous. So I'm a bit gutted about the marks on it, but I'm hoping they wash out. Because this was really nice. I'll leave this, the prices on the screen, by the way, because they don't have prices on. They're, like, covered up because I got them on the internet, which is a bit weird, but anyway. And then, also, um, I ordered this one in light of beer gardens being open and it being freezing cold outside, but you still got to plan cute outfits. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? So, this is literally, like, oh, the lighting is lush. It's just a long-sleeved. Zora did a top like this at one point, but it was three-quarter sleeve. It's a long-sleeved, like... Can you see that? It's got fluff on it, but ribbed um, top again in an extra small. Um, you can get matching leggings, matching, matching leggings to this, but I didn't because I knew that they'd be too short because the Zara ones were, and I'm pretty sure they're like the same make or something. I don't know. In an extra small again, don't know how much the price was. Why? Why does it put this on top? Why would it do that? But yeah, it basically. You'll see on the trial, but it like scoops down here. Fits really nice. Don't need to wear a bra. You know, I don't know about if you've got bigger, but don't really need to wear a bra. Did actually put a cardigan on that I got on top of this, which was stupid because now, I don't know if you can see, it's got white fluff all, all over it, all over it. But I love this. It literally fits so nice. And like I say, it's just a staple. You need to go with like jeans, under a blazer, anything like that. Really good quality. That's what I'll say about this stuff. It's really good quality. And then I ordered quite a few white little tops because I don't have any. And definitely for summer, they're a staple. But you know, order enough pretty little thing like they're just going to be see through. You know, they're going to be see through because they're cheap. And I was like, well, I don't know. I really need, like, I don't think I've ever ordered a white top that's not see through. So anyway. I saw this on TikTok actually in green, but they didn't have the green in stock, so I got the white one. Looks like this at the front, just you know your average. What is with this exposure? And then at the back, oh my gosh, look at that. If she can, uh, there we go. Yeah, so she's just got these strings all around the back. So yeah, in an extra small again, seamless collection. Um, really think this is just so cute, and backless things are so flattering, but I don't own anything that's backless because of the whole 
no bra situation seeing your nips it's just not she's not ideal next up little white top again this one's like a t-shirt one this is the same as the black one so you'll see the cut out more but short sleeved um just a staple staple for joggers staple this with some little blue denim shorts omg with a tan can we please Look at some and this is it's just so like stretchy and comfy and it just feels nice. And then I got another white little top. This one's a different um style. What is with this exposure? Right, there you go. Um yeah, just it's in a size extra small again, limitless what is it? What is it called? Seamless contour. Just white ribbed, really simple. I haven't actually tried this one on yet, but She's just dead flattering, isn't it? Tops like these are just my go-tos to wear every day, especially when I'm even working or anything like that. I got this on a bit of a whim. I'm not a cardigan girl, but I just... You know, you're just sick of seeing yourself in the same thing, and people on TikTok just look so cute in things like this, and I was like, do you know what? I don't think it suits me. I mean, like, it's actually massive. For an extra small, definitely you don't need to size up. I just... Like, what kind of top do I wear with it? Please someone tell me. I don't know, it's kind of cute, but the same... Why am I so exposed? There we go. I don't know. I don't think it's a bit of me. I'll try it on with like something that will match it, but it is really nice. Like, you know, it's super lightweight, whatever. Again, just thought it'd be cute as like a jacket option for when you're going out. Like, it's not dressy, but it's just like cute. Do you know what I mean? the buttons i really i really do like this i really like the idea of it but i just don't think it's me i'll actually show you this little set that i got from opoly because i mean well it's from bowen t but it's just been sat waiting for ages because i can't wear shorts yet so look how tiny these are do not come for me i am the teeny tiniest person ever anyway i don't even know if i've shown you these before bowen t shorts i actually got these for 10 pound in like this office sale thing that they did and then this is the matching top, which I haven't ever owned anything like this shape before, but it's quite cute. I quite like the red. I don't know, it's kind of something different. I'm a bit unsure on it, but I think like wearing this when it's red art with some converse. Chef's case, beautiful. So we'll add that to the pile. And then next we'll go with Zara because it's it's basically the same theme as Trinavarius, but a little bit different. So um, these were new in and I was like, yep, need them. Cost me £11.99 each, and so the same top but different colours. So, like I was saying, you know, we need white tops. This one's kind of cream, but looks like this. It's got like this pattern at the bottom. This was really popular in the green, that green set, which I would have loved, but it sold out very quick. Thanks to TikTok. Um, so, yeah, it just looks like. So, really comfy, fits nice. It's a size extra small to small. Um, this is the Limitless Contour Collection. Again, it's quite see-through. Well, not quite see-through, but you can see through it. And then I actually got, got a pop of colour. Went for red. Um, don't know how I feel about red clothes. Like, And then when I bought this as well, I was like, what am I going to wear that with? I don't have any joggers that will match it. Like, what do you actually wear red tops with? I don't know. So, guess what I did? Went on to print on thing. Yeah, never mind. But, um, yeah. Same thing. Really cute on the bottom. Just thought this would be so cute again in the summer, you know. Gold chain, gold hoops, denim shorts, Converse, or Air Force with long socks. Beautiful. Beautiful outfit planning. Get me somewhere to wear that too. So yeah, anyway, we're going to put a little thing now because um, these are the joggers I bought. So these were £8 in the sale and I was like, I just, I'll try them. They're a size medium. I'm definitely not a medium. I was like, do you know what? I ordered some joggers from Pretty Little Thing and they come bigger than what a large must be. So these probably will fit. I mean, they do fit around the waist. Like, they do sit on my hips, but they just have a lot of gathering around here, which isn't really very cute. And I don't, I don't, I'm not a massive fan, but like, what else am I going to wear that I told me? Somebody tell me. But yeah, they say Solo Town on them. I actually did a haul before and I got these in green. But these are the red ones in size medium. I mean, kind of cute, kind of cute. I don't know. I probably won't end up keeping them because they just don't fit me very well. Like they're not flattering. And then this was on my little jean 
Jean Hunt. So these were loved by everybody on the private story. However, they're too short. They just are too short. Like if they were this much longer then they'd be fine. But they literally sit at like a weird place on my ankle where they just don't look long enough. Like you know how jeans that are baggy are meant to like bag around your trainer? They don't do that. So I'm like, well, that's not cute. Um, so really fun. They have that asymmetric asymmetric waist which i just think that's so cute so these are really flattering actually even though they are i'll tell you what they're called they're the oh, petite washed black baggy low rise asymmetric waistband two in size two because size four is just huge which you'll see i'll try all of these on for you just for the just for the laughs because you will really discover how hard it is Buy jeans from Pretty Little Things department. Yeah, anyway, so these are a size two, so they do fit around the waist, but they are too short. So they look like this look. They're just straight, basically, all the way down. And, like, they're quite flattering, like, on the back and stuff, because when they're too big, they're just not. But these are, but too short, like I said a million times now. Got this cute little rip in the middle. Can I just say, I don't think I own a... I don't think I own a pair of black jeans that aren't the Joni jeans, which I just go for every time, because they're such a safe option. But I really need something like this, but I just don't fit. So anyway, I actually ordered another pair of these um, to see if, you know, maybe it was just a design for and that those ones would come longer. They didn't, so now that's just another, like, £23 that's just sat out of my bank for no reason. Um, so yeah, after I bought them and was devastated when they didn't fit, I ordered... Drumroll please, ladies and gents. I ordered these. Now these are petite again. Black baggy low rise distressed boyfriend jeans in a size two. So after I bought the asymmetric ones, I was like, right, okay, kind of nice to have your belly button out because the one nice thing about being as small and petite as I am is that you've got a nice waist. So I was like, do you know what? We'll get the belly out. These these are not low low rise at all. Like these are the teeny tiniest waist jeans I've ever found, which is, but because they're meant to be low rise, they're therefore not long enough. To sit so high up on my hips so i'm just still not found a pair of jeans um but they look like this anyway really cute you know just your basic black wash baggy distressed jeans just not long enough honey my legs are too long but my waist is too small but like they're so gorge and the waist is it fits she fits oh so that was them but anyway next i'll show you my fun joggers that i bought we'll take a little jean break or shall we carry on with the jean story maybe we should carry on with the jean story the joggers can definitely wait we'll um leave the plt on a high note oops ripped the bag brb bought these jeans and i have actually sent them back and reordered them since because again thought maybe it was just a mishap with the sizing now these are my perfect blue coloured jeans. I love this blue. I'm not a dark blue denim kind of gal. I don't really like it, but these, these are the light blue wash distressed boyfriend jeans in a size four. So these aren't petite, but when I tell you the waist on these is huge, they don't like they don't stay up. They don't even stay up and they're literally just because they're a four and not in the petite size two. It's just stupid how big the size 4 jeans are like surely not but these aren't as wide because did I say they were mum jeans no they were boyfriend jeans again but these aren't as wide so they actually fit nicer they've got this massive rip here and then they've got oh this huge rip here and here so I literally love these but they they are far far too big around the waist like to the point it makes it unflattering on the bum so that's another pair of jeans that I've got to send back this pile of jeans is she's high um this is i think yeah this is the second pair of asymmetric jeans that i bought let me just compare the size of the waist so this is a size two of the black pair and then the blue pair in size four look at that is that a joke am i a joke to you what is that about no i'm just not very happy I just want a pair of jeans, like, what am I meant to go out in if I can't buy a pair of jeans that fits? And if anyone even tries to tell me that I've not tried, then I'll just 
what is this? There's literally seven pairs of jeans sat on my floor. Like, what? I have literally invested in Pretty Little Things shares at this point, just through jean sales. Finally, 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 um, bleach wash baggy low rise distress boyfriend jean size four. Again, thought, wow, wow, that'd be cute. I can't really remember how these fit, to be honest. These are kind of cute. Oh, these are too short again. These are too short again. I think, I don't know. I don't know. But these are like, well, they're like kind of acidy, washish, bleach, bleach thing, you know what I mean? Um, I can't remember what was wrong with these, but they didn't hit the spot either. So, I just, if you're asking me to go somewhere, ask me when it's 27 degrees and I can show up in shorts, okay? Okay. Finally. Finally, finally. Not even finally. I keep saying finally. You know when in the end. Keep watching. Right, so, wait. I bought the most summer, spring, coolest, happiest colour joggers you've ever seen from Pretty Little Thing, and they literally cost me like a tenner. These, you need to get these. If you don't have these in your life, they are gorgeous. They're not huge, they're not too baggy, they're flattering, they're so thick and comfy. I love them. So I got these in size 4, and like I say, they literally were like £10. So I loved them that much that I actually went and bought them in the other colour that they did because, you know... Are you, are you surprised? No, me neither. So this is the lilac pair. Wow, I've not even got these out of the bag yet. So yeah, these are the lilac pair. Again, I got them in size four. They're called the, well, these are the Lavender Double Stripe Joggers from Pretty Little Thing. They've got a drawstring waist and everything. Oh, they've got fluff flying everywhere. Just love these, you know, because, like, because it's spring at the moment. I say this is a summer haul, but because it's spring at the moment, it's still cold. So like wearing joggers on the bottom and then a cute little summer top on the top, denim jacket, out the door, good to go, get your shopping trip done, whatever and whatever. And then, this is also from a pretty little thing which I love. It's one of them bando tops, scarf tops, but it's like, I don't know how to describe it, it's stretchy material, it's not like silk, it's one size, um, it's called the pink bandana print hanky hem bando crop top. Um. I literally love this and because it's stretchy it's just like dead easy to tie up or whatever really cute like with some low-rise jeans it looks so nice but can't really can't say I've got any of them but yeah this is so good for like you know when it's red 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 hot if you can remember that time of life then shout out to you because I'm struggling to remember but and you just you just don't want to wear clothes but you have to because you can't leave the you can't leave the house naked that's not okay so put something like that on and some not denim shorts we're not wearing denim shorts this time some comfortable like material shorts good to go you're good to go finally finally no not finally oh my god stop saying finally you're toxic asos haul asos haul so um got on my red pink bright color vibe shopping looking for was in full swing by the point that we got on to ASOS which had 25% off last week which is my reasoning for the splurge I got this reclaimed vintage t-shirt because I've ordered something from reclaimed vintage before and they're so nice like the quality is so nice and everything like this was a bit price well it wasn't pricey at all for a t-shirt but more money than the ones that were from collusion I bought oh there's a man staring at the window hey honey hey um so yeah literally love anything like this and also don't know if i told you i bought a t-shirt from the girls bathroom merch the don't call me t-shirt because don't call me but um it it was so small like it was so small like i like my oversized t-shirts to be like you know the sleeves need to be like down here it needs to be baggy it needs to be oversized it needs to be cool and it was like a it was gross so i ordered this in a small and it's just like these kind of sleeves are what I'm talking about in a t-shirt. This is literally lush. Do we think I should keep this? Let me know. But it's really nice. Exactly what I expected. And you should definitely check out Reclaimed Vintage on ASOS if you haven't. 
before because they have really nice stuff and it is so hard to like shop for stuff on ESOS because there is so much. By the way, this is the the situation of clothes. And then oh my god, this one's this one's funny. So, oh my god, when I say this is the softest material ever. This is such a comfy top. So I ordered this in a size small. This is absolutely humongous. Like, yeah, you could fit about five of me in this. This is literally like, I'm hungover, don't talk to me. I'm wearing my hungover t-shirt. But I'm so good because it's out of stock in all sorts of small sizes. So then, I ordered another collusion t-shirt. Um, and I was like, let's size down. Like, let's reel this back a bit. Let's size down. I got a size, by the way, this is the most fun t-shirt you'll ever see in your life. Size extra small, wow, who would have guessed? I mean, I think they go down to an extra extra small. No, the smallest size of this was an extra small. Look how, this is what the girls bathroom t-shirt fit like. It's just so fitted. I was literally like, ew. Went back on the website, two sizes up. One day later. DPD knocking on my door again. I honestly think they had that I. I honestly think they must have thought that something was going on up here with me the past week because they were at my door every day with an ASOS parcel. Um. Look at the size difference. Look at her. She is stunning. Yeah. So this is a medium. This is two sizes bigger. Medium, whatever. This one is so much nicer. Like I don't know. Maybe if that's how you want it to fit, but like to see. Look, this is the size difference on the sleeves. What is that all about? To say that, like, these are the same as this, like, that small's the same as this one. No. No, it's not. So, don't get catfished by collusion, even though they do do some of the nicest clothes. Well, like, t-shirts and stuff, to be honest. Actually, I've got some really nice joggers from there as well, so. Be beware with your sizing, like, I don't really know how to even judge it myself. And then finally, clothes from ASOS. Oh my god, I got this pretty blue top, but look at the bag. It's got orange on it. Oh my god, I think this is a men's top. I mean, I was surprised. Just thought some new oversized t shirts. Wow, look at that. I literally love when text is across the back like my, like, like this. Um, And yeah, thought orange was really cute. 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 Really cute. So that's what that's what that's like again huge i didn't know if this one was too big then i thought it's actually big enough to wear without like trousers you know what i mean like if you put some shorts on underneath you could go out with just this and it'd look quite cool you know imagine like a day to autumn towels or something you've got your big baggy t-shirt on you've got your cross body bag on and then for me so we actually got some little accessory bits because i just couldn't help myself so since i got my gold hoops i was like i actually have no other gold accessories that can match this vibe so i ordered this ring which i've had my eye on for a while actually look how cute this is i'm sorry what look how cute this is cost me six pound um however this is a size small and it was small like this fits on like my little finger so i ordered it in a medium that's currently in my car this one needs to go back but definitely recommend this it's so pretty Fun rings, fun rings, we love fun rings. I mean, I'm not really, I don't know how I feel about the, you know, like the ones that everyone's wearing at the moment. If you know what I mean, you know what I mean, but if you don't, then. This is just another way of being fun, but not being too out there. And then next up we have, oh my God, I have to show you this. So I was like, oh, we'll get another cute little gold chain because you can never have enough, obviously. I got catfished on the website. I really did get catfished. Look how huge this chain is. I've not even opened it, but I'm going to open it for you. So this is from Monkai. Monkey, Monkai. Bro, what is that? It's so big. It's literally huge. Like, look how big that is. It's just disgusting. Like, oh my god, it's cold. And, I mean, maybe it'd suit some people, but I'm too little and dainty for this. I just look like a trap star or something. So I was quite disappointed because I thought it was going to be like literally like like this kind of thickness. Not this kind of thickness, you know? Oh dear. So we'll put that back in the package and kindly send that back to ASOS because mm, not today, honey. If we can get her back in there. 
gone. Which is so cool. Don't worry, you'll be back. Back, back there. And it was sold out as well. So, I, and then it came back. And I was like, oh, really quick buy it. But I can see why someone sent it back now. That's not cute, honey. And then, oh my God, if you've not seen Sophia and Chintzy on London Vlogs yet, these are essential. I've not opened them yet again. Um, we cannot accept returns once this bag is open. Look at these gold hoops. Right, so we're just into gold hoops at the moment. I don't even, like, I don't even know how I'm going to feel about these, but every time I see Sophia and Chintzy in them, I'm like, I need them. It cost me like a fiver again. So I was like, well, do you know what? Why would I not get them? View up. Just fun for summer. All I'm on this summer is fun, 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 fun. And then I actually bought, in addition to the Sophia and Chintzia, um influenced, I finally caved and bought this because I do my hair with the got to be glued glue and it's just so like, what's the word? So strong. Like, it's just too much sometimes. Like, I feel like this is, like, base. Base. Base, base, base. Oh, uh, yeah, base. By the way, it smells like the old woman's house that I clean. But look at that. Wow, she's beautiful. Um, yeah, if I put this on and then just, like, touch up with the thing. Because otherwise, if I put my hair up with that, it won't move for, like, the next three days. And it's just... I can't brush it through it even because then I'll have flakes of glue in my hair and dandruff. It's not cute. So I thought this is just, you know, got 25% off. I was like, best time to buy it. Like, if I'm going to buy it, then just, just buy it now. Just buy it now. Finally, and I mean finally this time, Primark haul. Now, I went back to take that swimsuit and that photo frame back. If you watched my last haul, then you'll know. So, Emily Archer, hi if you're watching. Hi if you're not. That's awkward, but... I picked up some more bits, so, <laughs> clown. I got these tops that everyone's, that everyone went crazy for and obviously sold out the first time I went, but they actually restocked them. Now, I had the grey one of this literally ages ago. Like, there's some stuff in Primal that everyone's raving over now that I had ages ago. Not to flex, but, yeah, these are literally like all of that seamless stuff that I've got from Zara and um, Shadavarius, but from Primark, cost me £3. And it's from the pyjama section actually, but it's like double lined around the around the boobs, so even better for not having to wear a bra. Like these are ideal. Definitely get your hands on some of these if you can. I got the white one as well, but that's in my drawer. Did someone just knock at the door? I don't know. If they did, then I'll have to wait. Next up, bought some little black shorts. Primark's clothes are getting bigger and bigger, like, and the sizes aren't changing with them. So these are a size 2XS. 2XS, size 4 to 6. They're just black ribbed pyjama shorts. Like, they cost me, how much? £3. You, just, you can't go wrong. You can't have enough shorts, you know. They're just comfy. Just comfy. So I was like, wow, well, yeah, they're cute. And then, also from the pyjama section, ooh, I bought this cute little lilac racer top. But it's a, a bed top. A bed top. Pyjama top. Cost me... Um, how much did it cost me? Three pound again. Thought I can definitely wear this with them lilac joggers, 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 joggers. But by the way, this is so small. Like this is really tight. So maybe size up in that. And then I actually got another one of them sets. I got the white one. However, the grey one can I just say fits different to the red one that I had. It's too big. So I don't know whether this one's going to be too big. And if it is, then I'm going to be really, really, really upset because she obviously can't return them. I need a 2XS, but then, oh, I don't know. It's just too big, like, round here. Like, there's just unnecessary material, and there isn't any other one, so I don't I don't know what's about. Kind of upset, but whatever. And then, finally, finally, oh, we got some green sheets, because she's having a room green, and these are just essential. If you don't get your sheets from Primark, then where are you buying them from? Because I swear these are the cheapest. 170 for two pillowcases, and then 580 for the fitted sheet. Straighten my basket off. And then I got some more black ones because you can never have enough. Mum would argue differently. But yeah, that is... That is the end of the haul. Thank you so much if you have watched this long, far, long... Oh my God, it's like 34 minutes long. That's disgusting. 
have a nice weekend you enjoyed my haul and i am definitely here for doing hauls if you enjoy them the most then let me know i'll always keep filming them for you let me know if you buy anything and i will see you in my next video let me know if there's anything you want to see but anyways love you all bye <laughs>